Hello, and welcome to Effect House. Today, we'll help you familiarize yourself with the tool as well as live demo some cool features. Effect House is a platform that can be used to create augmented reality effects. You can combine different assets and interactions to build virtual elements that are applied onto a user's face, body, and environment. After creating your AR effects, you can publish and share them on TikTok for people all over the world to experience. Sounds really exciting, right? Feel free to go to our website and download Effect House. Before we dive into Effect House, let's first go through the general process for creating an effect. You can start building your effects by first importing or creating assets, designing the functionality, and then previewing your effects in the tool or on TikTok. After you have your finished effect, you can submit it for review. If your effect passes review, it will be published and go live. When you first open Effect House, there are some built-in templates to help you create effects without having to start from scratch. They can also help you learn a feature by providing a reference point. Let's start with an example by opening the 3D face mask template. When you open or create a new project, you'll be able to see Effect House's interface. On the top left is the hierarchy panel. The hierarchy panel shows the objects you added to the effect and the layers of the objects in the scene. You can also add built-in functional objects by clicking Add Object. Below the Hierarchy panel is the Assets panel. The Assets panel is the library for all of your imported assets. You can simply drag assets into the panel or click Add Asset and choose Import to add specific assets like Texture Sequence and 3D Face Binding Mesh. It also has built-in materials and textures for your convenience. In the center is the 3D workspace reflecting your effect. You can zoom, pan, and rotate the 3D view. Or you can select the object and use the gizmo to manipulate the transform of the object. The view can also be switched between 3D and 2D scenes if you add any 2D objects. Next to it is the preview panel, which shows your effect work in progress. There are a few built-in videos to test your effect in different environments. You can also open the webcam to test your effect on yourself or a variety of skin tones to ensure your effect is inclusive and looks good on everyone on TikTok. At the bottom, there are some buttons for you to customize the preview window. These include choosing a different device ratio or showing or hiding the TikTok UI. You can also take a screenshot or record a demo video. On the far right is the inspector panel, where you can see that each object in the hierarchy panel is broken down into multiple components, which can be changed by modifying their properties. For example, when you click the lighting resource, it will show the lighting components with the properties assigned to it. Feel free to tweak the color or the other properties and see how it will reflect on the preview. And finally, on the bottom is the Visual Scripting panel. In this panel, you can implement interactions in an effect by simply connecting nodes together instead of writing any code. Next, let's play with some cool features in Effect House. If you go to the Hierarchy panel and click Add Object in AR Tracking, you will see that we support Head Tracker, Body Avatar Drive, Hand Tracker, as well as AR Camera that enables device tracking. When you select Head Tracker, Effect House will create a functional Head Tracker object along with the head-shaped occluder. For every object that you parent underneath it, it will follow the head's movement. The occluder will also help to occlude other 3D objects in the scene. For example, if a hat model wraps around the head, we can occlude the back of the hat so it looks natural. The steps are the same for the body avatar drive or hand tracker. After adding the body avatar drive and parenting a character to it, the character will be driven by the people in the view. It really is straightforward and simple. Additionally, we support multiple face effects for limitless creativity. For 3D face, you can create a dynamic 3D face mask that matches face motions and gestures. And when you add a face mask and eye color, it will help to create 2D face makeup effects. 
For face stretch, you can easily customize the face shape by manipulating key points. Face inset will cut out part of the face elements. Feel free to tweak the transform and apply some color to it. Face Sticker will make it easier to attach a 2D image to a specific face anchor, while Face Liquify will help to magnify the face in hilarious ways. We also support audio and have many other cool and interesting features like post effect and segmentation. Feel free to add and explore these objects. Last but not least, let's demonstrate how to use visual scripting. In this example, we will implement the interaction that uses the mouth open and close to control the visibility of the 3D face. First, right-click the panel to add the trigger node, Facial Movement Detection, and select the movement to Mouth Open. Add the Set Visibility node, and drag the 3D face object into the Visual Scripting panel. Connect the 3D face to the object input of Set Visibility, and Facial Movement Detection begin to the Enter of Set Visibility. Check the value because we want the object to be visible when the camera detects mouth open. Next, copy and paste a new Set Visibility node and connect Facial Movement Detection End to trigger it. Uncheck the value so the entity will be invisible when the mouth closes. When we finish the effect, press Restart to refresh your effect. If you want to test and preview your effect, press Preview in TikTok to generate a QR code. Use your mobile device to open TikTok and scan the QR code to preview your effect. After you are satisfied with your effect and feel ready to publish, click Submit and give your effect a cool name. Remember to follow the instructions to design an icon for it. Click Continue and it will direct you to the Effect House webpage with your account login. Here, you can complete your effect details like choosing the category and tags or uploading demo videos to help creators better understand your effect. After finishing all the steps and clicking Submit, please wait for a few days for your effect to get approval. If you want to learn more information about publishing or detailed functionalities, click this icon and it will direct you to the Effect House website to view our learning resources. Our resources include guides to walk you through every function, from general submission and tutorials that introduce template effects to articles that give examples on each visual scripting node. That's all for now. Thank you and see you in Effect House.